I never felt fine with myself, but it was just something that I came across that I thought would make me look better. Using makeup to hide insecurities is not uncommon, but for Riley Hubin, her self-confidence struggle began as a young girl. I was bullied ever since I was a kid. I was born in the mainland. My skin isn't light. They either called me Muslim or a wetback. They called me the N-word. They would throw notes at me saying that I was stupid, ugly, no one would love me. Imagine being that young and having people just breaking you down because you were different. Unable to recover, Riley's mentality only worsened. I would hurt myself. I would burn myself. I would cut myself. I would hit myself and pull out my hair. I basically treated my body like clay. I was just trying to fit myself into like all these waist trainers and trying to mold my body into something else that wasn't mine. Riley was then inspired to use makeup as a coping mechanism. Seeing that my mom would wear it just to seem presentable, I thought that I could do the same thing. But then I started to become obsessed with a different picture. I absolutely hated myself. I really wanted to die. However, an encounter in 2016 made all the difference. There was the one incident where a girl walked up to me and she was like, you're wearing a lot of makeup. At this point, I was just trying to embrace myself as much as I could. So I took a makeup wipe, I took it all off, and I was like, okay, I'm gonna face my biggest fear today, walk out there with a bare face, and just be me. It just took a while for me because I didn't know how to accept myself because I based myself off of other people's opinions. But now I'm just gonna flaunt my beauty and who cares what other people think. Riley now hopes to inspire others when doing makeup professionally. I would make it so that they look good to people around them, but also to themselves because I don't want them to feel like they have to put on that facade. I don't think that makeup makes someone else's face look better, but your face makes the makeup look better. Riley continues to wear makeup, but with a renewed perspective. I feel like I can wear makeup just because I want to look better. Like, let's be real. Like, do you see this face? Like, it's great. It's glowing. I don't have to impress anyone else but myself. You're not going to change who you are simply by putting on this mask. Go out there and just live a little. Comfortable in her own skin, Riley is finally both confident and happy. This is Caitlin Izumigawa from HP Baldwin High School for Hikino.